Hello, this is Ryan from Heaviosity. Today I'm going to walk you through all of the content included in Novo, Modern Strings. Novo contains 40 gigabytes of multi-sampled violins, violas, cellos, and basses, as well as a vast library of processed strings in the form of pads, hits, rhythmic beds, and loops. The traditional folder contains the violin, viola, cello, and bass sections in separate presets, as well as high and low ensemble presets with more specialized articulations. In each preset, you can select your desired articulation by clicking on it or by using the key switches starting on F6. You'll notice each articulation has different controls and displays, which we'll cover in depth in the traditional string instruments tutorial. There are four channels in the mixer where you can control the volume and panning of the three different mic positions as well as a full mix channel, which is purged by default. Whenever you encounter a button like this with a P on it, it can be used to purge that channel from memory, reducing the overall memory footprint of the instrument. This is especially useful on machines with a limited amount of RAM. The traditional string instruments interface offers several controls for shaping your sound, including a per-channel EQ and filter, an ADSR volume envelope, a rhythmic gate and arpeggiator, and a space module with delay and reverb. Each preset includes snapshots for different mixes, reverb, and EQ settings. The Evolved folder contains the String Designer, a dynamic instrument that can be used for creating pads, effects, and rhythmic beds, as well as the Loop Designer, used for layering tempo-synced loops into rhythmic passages. The String Designer offers three separate channels, each with selectable sound sources from a vast library, including the organic string samples, 100 processed pads, and over 430 tempo-synced loops, all categorized by timbre. There are multiple controls for each channel, including envelope shaping, EQ, filter, a drive module with multimode distortion and saturation, rhythmic gate, and a space unit for delay and reverb. There is also a set of master effects for additional sound shaping. Perhaps the most powerful aspect of the string designer is Heaviosity's brand new dynamic playback engine, Cycle. Cycle boasts a set of controls that can quickly create rhythmic pulses, swells, stutters, and glitch effects, as well as effectual granular style pads for ambient drones and textures. I'll cover in depth the interface and controls of the Cycle page in its own separate tutorial. The string designer includes almost 200 handcrafted snapshots categorized by sound quality. Each uses a unique combination of sound sources and effects to achieve a wide variety of pads, hits, rhythmic beds, and arpeggiating sequences. The loop designer has a similar layout. The three channels can be loaded with loops in straight or triplet subdivisions. The loops are organized into banks which indicate the range of instruments used as well as the quality of sound. All of the banks are also available with reversed versions of the loops. The designer page allows you to use keys C1 through B1 as selector keys, which trigger three loops at once. The loop designer includes 36 unique snapshots, which populate the designer with different combinations of the various loop types. Both the Loop Designer and String Designer include the Macro Control Knob, which can be assigned to control parameters of various per-channel effects. The Macro Knob is incredibly powerful and versatile. It can be used to add subtle movement to your sound or to drastically transform it. It can also be sequenced to move in rhythmic patterns according to the tempo of your host sequencer. For more information on the different types of presets, please see the preset-specific tutorials for the traditional string instruments, string designer, and loop designer. Novo Modern Strings is available now at heaviosity.com.